Hey guys, welcome back. My name's Om and this week I'm breaking down the interstellar pixel stretch scene. Let's get started. So this might be a bit controversial, but I've never liked this film. It's a good idea, but was implemented kind of poorly. And he doesn't even care about his son who actually kept in touch with him. But anyway, let's get back to the tutorial. So... So the important thing for this effect to work is that you have to have footage where there's movement and some sort of dimension, either colour or buildings changing or the person walking through. Something like this, where it's just water and feet, where the colours are very similar, the effect works but doesn't really come through. So I'm going to use this footage of a child walking around this building. Once you have your footage, create a comp and go to the effects and presets panel and type scale wipe and drag and drop this onto the footage. Now, initially, you won't see anything happen until you increase the stretch, even by a little. One point to note here is that the lower the number on the stretch, the more of a bulge or a rounded edge you'll get to the effect. As I want it to be straight lines like the movie, I'm going to take it up to the highest value, which is 100. Perfect. I, n I have my straight lines, but I'm getting a gap at the bottom corner here as the angle of the effect is going off in a direction. So go to direction and change it from 50 to 90 degrees. Brill. Now I also have the whole shot covered. Now the last, uh, what do you call this? Preset, function, adjustment, whatever, in the, uh, in the scale wipe is the center. This is the location of where you want the effect to start. As I want the effect to start at the corner of this pillar where the child is and then follow him going up, follow him going from right to left hand side of the screen, I'm going to start here. To do this, make sure you're at the beginning of the timeline and click on the stopwatch button. And then move it across every couple of frames, not every frame, every couple of frames to follow the boy going across. And you're done. It's that simple. Once you have the effect down, you can play with it and see how it works with color like this. Let me know if you like this video guys by hitting the like button, smash the, sus smash the subscribe button, smash the subscribe button and help me get to 15k, it's kind of hard, smash the subscribe, smash the subscribe button, imagine saying that five times, and as always, stay inspired.